In this video, we'll do some more calculations with force. So remember that force is mass times acceleration, but acceleration is change in velocity over change in time. So if we simply substitute this in, we get force is mass times change in velocity over change in time. So just do a quick example. If I have a velociraptor and it's at rest and I push it with love, and I push it and it gets to 5 meters per second and it does that in 0 0.5 seconds and it has a mass of 65 kilograms we can figure out how much force was applied All right, so the force is going to be the mass I'm going off of this equation up here 65 kilograms times the change in velocity well the final velocity is 5 meters per second the initial was 0 meters per second because it was at rest the time it took to go from 0 to 5 meters per second was 0 0.5 seconds, which means my force is, okay, 5 minus 0 is uh, 5 divided by 0 0.5 is 10 meters per second squared, times 65 is 650 newtons. So we see that we can just do a normal force calculation if we're solving for acceleration the long way. The nice thing about this equation, though, is that it opens up some more intuition. Just kind of thinking about it should make sense. Right? So what this equation is saying is that you'll have a high force every time you have a high change in velocity. And if you have a high change in time, you'll have a smaller force. Right? Because if you have a high change in time, the denominator gets bigger. So this number overall, the acceleration number, gets smaller. So your force is smaller. And this is kind of how airbags work, right? So if you have like a steering wheel here, and here's you. Right? The reason that it's really important to have airbags or a seatbelt is that if you're zooming around and then you hit something that makes you stop and your head hits the steering wheel, well, however fast you were going was your initial velocity. Your final velocity is zero. So your head stops moving when it hits the steering wheel. That's a high change in velocity and a really short amount of time. Right? It's a whiplash. Which means that you have a high acceleration, which means that there's a high force that hits you in the head. That's bad. Do not like. So we get airbags, seat belts and stuff. Right? So now airbag deploys. The same change in velocity, right? However fast you're going, eventually your head comes to a stop. But through all this pillowy goodness, it takes a long time for your head to stop. So you have a high change in time, which means that you have a low acceleration, which means there's a small force on your head. This is good for your brain. Yay. So I want to rearrange this equation once to give it my favorite form. So if we multiply both sides by change in time, boom, boom, and we divide both sides by mass, we solve for a change in velocity, right? So that means that change in velocity is force times change in time over mass. And again, this should make sense. This is mean this is just saying that the longer you apply the force for, the more the thing will change its velocity. That should make sense. But the higher mass it has, the less its velocity should change. Again, that should make sense. So let's look at this. If I push a 65 kilogram velociraptor with 100 newtons of force for five seconds, what will be its change in velocity? Well, my force is 100 newtons. The change in time, well, I was pushing it for five seconds. It had a mass of 65 kilograms. Okay, that's 500 divided by 65. That'll give you something like 7.7 .7 meters per second, which means that if I use 100 newtons of force for five seconds, so I'm pushing this flash after pushing, 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 it'll get 7.7 .7 meters per second faster. It'll be moving 7.7 .7 meters per second faster by the time I'm done pushing. You can see that if I pushed it for longer, Right, remember, my force is making it accelerate. If I'm making it accelerate for longer, it will have a higher change in velocity. If I pushed harder, it would have a higher change in velocity. And that's it.